little bit hard to see. It's definitely uh, getting after it pretty good. I'm trying to figure out where I'm at here. Okay, we're almost there. All right, so we're gonna we're gonna head on up this steep driveway here and uh, see what we can do. I think I'm gonna back up it. That's what I did the other day. And uh, it's just way better to back up this thing. It's there's really there's only one way up this thing. narrow and steep so that even the skid steer is actually that one video with Owen he about slid off the mountain here and you definitely don't want to do that because it's it's going to take you for a ride all the way down to the road and uh, you just don't want to have that you don't want to have that so Back all the way up like I did the other day. Back all the way up this thing and uh, start from the top and push it all. Push some out this outside here and then the rest uh, the rest will go down the hill. up here in the trees. The trees really kind of block it, so that's kind of cool. down to the road so we don't want to don't want to go off that oops and I just hit that tree dusted that tree pretty good yeah it's just tight here guys put your operator skills to the test is what it does It, empty it out so we got a nice empty bucket for going down the hill here and then uh, what I'll do is get transitioned around here and get lined up and I will uh, I'll back over here into my storage area so I can get a get all the way up to the edge of my snow so I'm trying not to leave really much much leftovers up here you know where I want it and touchdown we're on the driveway now and we're just gonna ease our way down the down the road here and I'll go past this driveway just a little bit past so that we need to trim this branch right here because it's just knocking snow everywhere I'll 
I'll go past like that and I'll leave this pile here for a minute and I'm gonna back drag the driveway real quick see if I can give them a little back drag in the driveway here definitely not a user friendly uh, snow friendly property here it's a uh, it's a real pain if you can see out the window here that's like way on down there we don't want to go down there so I want to be very very careful and not, you got to pay attention because you're watching the front and then next thing you know you're backing off the side of the mountain and uh, things can get real ugly real quick when that happens uh, just take my time don't try to bites at a time. Go up here and grab some more. Pull this back. And of course you're on an angle so it, it doesn't want to get the whole bucket. You know what I'm saying? Like, square on the ground because the ground's so uneven and then when I once I do that then I'm then my front ends wanting to slide where and just go wherever which I don't like that maybe get one more out of there and then, uh, I think we're gonna have to I think we're gonna have to see that's good enough boys I mean for how tight it is loader in here it's it is what it is man it's all you can do i'm sure some guy on a blade will tell me he can do it way better which if i had a blade i it probably would be able to do it a lot better because uh you can really do get your angles and all that stuff where you want them you know but whereas this bucket you don't have all, you don't have all those choices that range of motion with the bucket here so there, there is drawbacks to the bucket definitely uh, buckets are more for when you're wanting to load trucks and um, things like that but you make it work with what you got you know that's what you do that's what we've always done and that's what we're going to keep doing it. so yeah I got that thing pretty clear now I'll peel this back and head on 
gone down with everything that I pulled out of that driveway. like Mike's over here might be just wrapping up with the, the back side here looks like you pretty much got it we're talking about today possibly being a two-pass day um, very well could be a two-pass day here we'll see bucket full of snow there once you get a little tunnel built it makes like a, a little push face in there you can see what we did behind us there I'm gonna keep moving I got other places to go but I just wanted to give him a little help real quick light out been going since about 4 a.m. I think it's probably I don't know a little after 7 now about halfway through it I'm gonna start heading back over towards uh, the other side of town and uh, over where the house is at and uh, get back over that way work on our place get it all opened up and a couple other jobs over by that over by our house and then I'm going to hop out of the loader and uh, go check on all the handwork guys and see how things are going with them. I would say the biggest drawback to this 914 is it just does not like the hill. It doesn't want to take any kind of hill at speed. It doesn't, doesn't have the oomph behind it to uh, push through. I mean, these hills, they slow everything down, the loaders. Um, when they're in high gear, but this one seems to just get down to a crawl and 
And then once you're back on level ground, you're back up to like 20 miles an hour. But uh, other than that, a little slow going up some of these hills, but uh, other than that, I'm real happy with this thing. And uh, it's doing a good job for us. Time to clean up our place a little bit. I have to move some of these vehicles. But, uh, <clears throat> I'm gonna have to get to it. I'll do the back. I'll open up this back area first so I can have a place to park some stuff and then kind of go from there. Okay. Definitely got a fair amount of snow on the ground. Sadie and Bud are all about that, huh? You gonna do a snow roll for the crowd, Sadie? Do a snow roll. Gotta do a snow roll. So we're gonna clear off some of these vehicles. Now that I opened up some of this right here, we'll, uh, I'll move everything over there and then I'll scoot this snow and then I'll move it again. So we got parking, but uh, still, still coming down pretty solid. And, uh, expecting uh six to eight more inches so we've already got at least a foot and then uh so this was actually more than what they called for and um yeah just having fun with it today sadie and butter loving it they've been wanting to get out and play in it so let them play here while i while i do some stuff here around the house okay i got my chest mount on so that ought to help me with my filming <clears throat> These little snow joes, they're handy for uh, getting stuff off quick. I'm gonna clear this one off too. I'm gonna we're gonna play around with this a little bit too, so I'll get it cleared off. That's a lot of snow, guys. I mean, that is a substantial amount of snow there. Pull that off. Get it fired up and let the uh, let the defrost go on it for a minute. Yeah, it's it's definitely a, a foot or more. Throw some of that in the back so it'll weigh it down, you know. Fire it up and get the heater going, huh? Okay, only got some snow. Turn that to hot. We're full of fuel, so that's good. Okay, there's that one. Once that window thaws out, I'll be able to see where I'm going. I guess I probably should have done this little spot right here first and parked there. And I got two spots over here I can park at, so we'll be all right. This one here, I'm just gonna do just enough to where I get inside of it because there's a lot of snow on these things. I'll have to drive with the door open so I can see where I'm going. Butchers. Okay, so we're just going to go back around up and uh Get her out of the way. <clears throat> the old Toyota 4Runner.
see nothing. Okay, let's make sure we're not gonna hit the truck. Oh yeah, we're good. Straight forward. Nope, that was too far. Yeah, of course, I got stuck. My dummy I went a little bit too far. We'll get it out later. That front wheel just kind of dropped off there. Okay, now we're gonna move the, uh, I'll move the Tahoe maybe right there. Sadie's having a blast, huh? Do your snow roll. Do your roll. <laughs> You're gonna do a roll. Do a roll for the crowd. Do your roll for the crowd. Oh yeah. They're having a good time. Okay. This one. Go ahead and same thing. This one, probably gonna go down to warming hut here in a little bit, so I probably better clear it off a little better. But, Got the snow today, guys. Got the snow. It's what we've been waiting for. What we've been waiting for. My hands are cold. I need a pair of gloves. see out the windshield here let's get moved over here <coughs> make sure I'm not gonna run anything over I can get by that without hitting it. Okay, let's turn the heater up. Get some defrostage going on here. There's bad. There's bad. Finally, there she's doing the snow roll for the crowd. Finally doing the snow roll for the crowd. They love the snow. That's their favorite thing, is the snow, I would say. <clears throat> okay. I think I'm gonna set up a time lapse so you guys can watch me do the driveway. And uh, I wanna use the, uh, the Ranger for some stuff. But I think I'm gonna 
it's quite a, it's quite heavy so i probably better use the loader first and uh get what i can with that <laughs> 